Sarah, thank you very much. Let me show you what the highs were not only in Detroit at 85, but around town. Lapeer, just as warm at 85, close to it. Pontiac, Port Huron, 87 in Adrian today. I've been calling it a June day. That's middle of July. That's big time heat. 84 in Ann Arbor, Pontiac, Monroe, Troy. Lots of big numbers around here. Flint was at 84 as well. Outside right now, pretty lights of the city. It has not calmed down a whole bunch. 72 still at the 10 o'clock hour here in September, middle of September. That's not the way it's supposed to be. 58 is the dew point. 61% humidity and east wind now at 6. The pressure has gone up just a little bit. It's that big high pressure that has uh, given us this long stretch of heat and the sunshine. 72 outside in Detroit, 66 in Ann Arbor right now, 65 in Lapeer, only 61 in Port Huron. So 70s around the city, 60s outside the immediate metro area. And as we go for Detroit, we're looking at a lot of stars. Now it says mostly clear at 4 o'clock. That's about the time we could start to see some fog form again, if it does. And if it does, it's probably done by 9 o'clock. But don't be surprised if we run into that in a few spots around town again tomorrow. We'll talk more about the leftover of Francine just a little bit. This thing is swirling up. We talked about this yesterday going up to the north first. It's going to go over the top of us because high pressure is just kind of blocking everything. We call it blocking high pressure because it makes everything kind of stay where it is or not get into the middle of the high pressure. It's so strong. That's the way it's going to be. So this is what's called post tropical Francine. It doesn't have a warm core anymore like a tropical system. It's got 25 mile per hour winds moving north at nine. It's around Memphis. That's important. All right, because I'm going to show you something here in just a second. Uh, goes up around Memphis, hangs around Memphis, doesn't move much farther through the night tonight or through tomorrow. And then this high pressure that's in control of us. See Memphis, it just kind of squishes it off to the southwest, doesn't let it really move too much toward us. So Memphis is where it stays for days and days and days. And as it does that, it falls apart. High pressure is in control. And by the time we get into the weekend, you can see its dominance. Everything is going around it. That's kind of a cool example of how strong and powerful this one is. 62 for a night in Detroit, maybe some fog in the morning. And then we get back to the sunshine. 83 pulling back just a couple of degrees here, but we're back to 84 for the weekend Saturday and Sunday. We'll have some football forecasts coming up.